Hello, hello everybody. I hope you guys are doing well. Um, today we're gonna do a review for these papers that I got. Um, I saw this video, uh, not this video, but I saw these uh, papers in Amazon before and I kind of wanted to try it because I saw how they look and I love making stickers with my Cricut. So I think they're wonderful how they look, but I saw that a lot of people are having trouble cutting uh, these papers with the machine. But again, I haven't tried these papers before. So we are gonna, you know, we're gonna do a, re a full review of these papers from the beginning to the end, <laughs> because again, I haven't tried them before. Um, you can see they're closed. I haven't even opened them. So uh, I just really wanted to try them. And this is a wonderful uh, place to start. So we're gonna review these papers and see if we have any troubles or anything cutting these papers with the Cricut. Um, as you can see, this looks like this. They're holographic. Holographic, I think you pronounce that that way. <laughs> um, and same as this, it looked like, you can see here, they look like they had some kind of like starts. They look wonderful and I'm really excited. They're in jet. And for what I saw on their website, they are waterproof. So let's see, let's see, let's, let's try and, and see what's going on. You see right here, it says it's waterproof. So, and it says, like don't put anything on it so we're gonna review the paper from the beginning to the end like i said before and let's see how it works uh let's open it So for what we can see, um, you know, they both have their instructions. You can see here, same thing uh, with this one, it's waterproof. Um, you know, it tells you not to put any clear coat on it because they're waterproof. We'll see that. <laughs> um, and they will, uh, they will tell you recommended, this, uh, recommended settings to print the paper. Same as this one, you know, just to have all the information. Uh, for what I can see, just, you know, to see the paper, they look like they're really good. Um, you know, they they look really good. So for now, we are in a good direction. Um, so let me show you guys in my computer the stickers that I'm going to print on it so we can follow the instructions and see what if we have any problems or anything that we can solve the problem with. So let's go to the computer. Okay, so here in Cricut Design Space, um, here are some designs that I already have done. Um, this ones are uh, done by me. Um, this ones are in actually in the images in Cricut Design Space. If you are subscribed to their um, membership, I think you can just get it for free. Stickers. So here are a bunch of stickers that you can use for free if you're subscribed. Um, and or you can just um, make it your own and just upload it but let's go back here so here are the ones that i'm gonna print um they're ready print then cut if you don't know how to do that you can visit my channel i have a couple of uh, tutorials that you can follow um all my videos are they have a subtitle like fake subtitles so you can actually follow the video uh reading this is video is just for uh, to review the paper. So here is the stickers and we're gonna make it. Here you can um, adjust the papers how you want them. Um, if you want them in like if you're gonna print in different papers, um, in my case I, I'm gonna print in two different papers, uh, color papers. So I'm gonna uh, change some of them to another Canva. So you can just go here to the three dots and move object. Um, you can make a new Canva or you can just make uh, move it to another one. Um, I'm gonna make another one. Here it goes. So I'm gonna start moving around. Okay, so I divided my stickers 
by the paper that I wanted to print them. Um, so you have, um, you know, I, I'm going to print in the same paper, paper um, I apologize, um, in the same paper, I'm going to print this ones and this ones. And the last one, I'm going to print in the other paper. You will see, <laughs> you will see now what I'm going to do, but I just want to explain that. So we press continue. So now we are ready to print. We're going to follow the instructions and what they recommend for the settings. So in here, we're going to send to printer. I'm going to pick my HP and I'm going to turn off the bleed. Uh, I don't think I need it. I think my Cricut is uh, uh, calibrated, so <laughs> I don't think I need it. I'm going to turn that off, but I'm going to turn the system dialog on. I'm using an Apple uh, computer, so if you have a window, maybe it looks different. I'm not sure. And then right on the back, you will see your settings. I don't know why they popped in the back, like always. <laughs> Move here. Okay, so here we're going to follow what they say. They recommend glossy photo paper or high glossy photo or other photo paper. In my case, I'm going to pick the photo glossy paper. And they recommend as well that you print the, the print quality is standard. So normal. If you pick best, you're gonna have way too much uh, ink. So that will that kind of that could be a problem. So just put it in normal, and that's it. We're gonna we're gonna print that, and let's see what happens. Okay, perfect. So now that we have print. Um, right the, the stickers we're gonna pick here the material that we're gonna use in my case i like to use this one you can find it of course in browse all materials but this is my favorite to cut stickers um you maybe can pick another one uh they do have another one up another option just for stickers um but i like this one because um it's for thicker uh material and I this paper actually says that it's waterproof and all perfect but I always have noticed that when they say waterproof but it's actually the paper is waterproof if your ink is not waterproof um, it's not gonna work sadly <laughs> so I like to put kind of like a self uh, like a laminating paper on top of it that way it makes it waterproof and some proof so you can put it on your car or anything like that I will show you later but for now, we're gonna uh, we're gonna pick this one, in my case, and let's go to the machine. So here are the papers. They look amazing. Oh my lord, I'm really excited about this. So, um, this is the paper that I'm that I was talking about. This is the paper that I use for laminating. Right, um, I'm gonna laminate just one paper. I'm gonna laminate this one, and I'm not gonna do this two. Uh, because this is a review, I just want to see how it works. But in this case, I, again, I'm just going to uh, laminate this one and not this two. But they look amazing and I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, and here's the other one. This is the one, um, the holographic with the little stars. You can see here. And this is just the holographic alone. Oh, they look amazing. I don't know, guys, but I love it so far. Well, we'll see if the Krika cuts it. So follow me here and we'll see. <laughs> Perfect. So easy to laminate these papers. So here is the paper that is laminated. So easy to cut. Ignore these areas that my <laughs> I had a tape on it and it kind of 
uh, it's dirty over here, but I don't need those areas, so I don't, I'm not gonna even clean it. But here is everything, and we're ready to cut and see how everything works. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so I got a cutting error. The machine had a problem cutting the paper. I don't know if it's because the laminating or not, but we will figure it out now. I'm gonna put this one that doesn't have the uh, laminating sheet on it. The machine caught it without the laminating with no problem. At least this one with the stars. I forgot to change the settings though, but it's okay, it caught it. That's the what we wanted it. But I forgot to change the settings to normal stickers because I don't have laminating in this. <laughs> so it caught it. I did not have any problems. Um, as you saw, I didn't have any problems cutting the papers with uh, without the laminating. Um, so so far so good. I the machine did not uh, had a problem seeing the uh, black lines around it. I did not have any problems again. But I have a lot of light on the on the room. Um, but we will try this one again because this one is different. So we'll see if we if we change anything on it. We'll see if this paper will cut. This is the different one. This is, doesn't have the stars. So we'll see if it cuts it without problems, just as the other one with the little stars. So we'll see. The machine cuts it. So definitely has something to do with the laminating paper. Okay. You know the machine cuts uh, the one. It cut the one with the star, and it cut the ones just with the regular uh, holographic holographic paper. So so far so good. I did not have a problem with those two. Um, this one that is laminating, I'm gonna try and try and, and cut it again, just without so much light. I have a lot of light in this room. Of course, because I'm trying to shoot this video for you guys, so I have a lot of lighting. But I didn't you know, have a problem cutting those two um, so far. A lot of people, you know, I have seen that they they said that if the the lens gets a lot of uh, light, it doesn't see the lines. So I'm gonna try with this and see if that helps at all. But again, this is the one with the laminating paper on it. And let's see, let's see what happens. It worked, it worked, it worked, it worked. Ignore my accident. I completely forgot to change the settings again. Uh, it's not the paper's fault, it's my fault. I forgot to change the settings because I was playing with the machine trying to see what the old ones to cut it. Uh, anyway. So if you put laminated paper, sometimes this happens with Cricut, um, it doesn't go through completely. So I use uh, this and it, it works to take all these stickers out. Um, and I did not use the proper setting for this, so I apologize. But I have another uh, tutorial where you can see how to do the proper uh, settings and everything with the laminating paper. So everything got cut. I'm so excited. I'm very happy. Um, as you saw um, on the video that what I did with the laminating ones, I just got a, this mat that I had and just kind of like put it on like on the lens kind of like you saw in the video. So that way the, the little lens did not saw that much light going in because of course I have a lot of lighting in the, in the room. So because I'm shooting this video again. So 
that helped with the laminating one. Um, with the other ones, I did not have to do that. I did not have any problems cutting. Um, maybe the laminating reflected the light a lot more, but with the other the other papers, I did not have that problem, and he cut it with, with no problems at all. Um, so I, I'm happy with that. Uh, so I don't know <laughs> what the other uh, people are saying, but at least I'm happy. Um, I had a little problem with the laminating one because I forgot to change the settings. People always change, you know, always, always, always verify your settings because before you cut, because that way you don't have problems and wasting paper like me. I forgot I put the pressure like to more, and when you're cutting with uh, the cardstock setting, you just leave it as default. At least for laminating stickers, just don't move it. That's, that was my, my mistake. I was, you know, playing around with another stickers. So it's not the paper, it's actually was me. But uh, the other ones, they caught amazing and I love it. I can't wait to do more of this. So I, I really, I love it. I don't have anything to say. I really love it. I don't know why the other people are in the reviews are saying that they had a problem. I'm not really sure what they're doing. So I hopefully this video will help uh, other people that want to use this kind of paper. Um, I again, I didn't have any problems uh, cutting the ones with without the lamination. What I did with this one, as you saw, I just kind of you know put this in here, and you know that way maybe the lamination was reflecting a lot. But after that, it cut it, no problem. So I'm very, very, very happy about that. And I can't wait to keep using this paper. So I'm gonna put on the description of the video everything that I use. So you guys can decide whatever you wanna do. But I'm also gonna put a coupon for uh, their website. So you can grab this paper or whatever you want. So anyway, if you like the video, please give me some thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. God bless you.